All right. Uh, notifications sent out. All right. Okay. Continue. Forgot what I was doing. <laughs> oh yeah, I gotta get. Um, I guess you can only have. Okay, uncovered the roots of a potential rebellion in Camelot. First, I gave him permission to investigate this matter further, hoping that it would make him stop complaining about not having enough to do. But finally, I decided to join him as well. I'd rather deal with betrayers in person. Hmm. Alright, we've got traitors in our midst. Watch out, they are close. Ah, Sir Morded. I'm honored to meet you in person. Sir Morded? What? Enough of the sweet talk. I know that you've betrayed us. Fool's talk. These men are here for gold, not for honor or the cause. Sounds like a poor excuse. Yes, we fight for gold, even against the Dread Knight, if we get paid. What if the f Ah, why are you talking then? Do what you are paid for. Just kick the fucking ass. Shall bleed. Um, for king and country, no mercy for the wicked. Ow. Oh. oh, they have reinforcements. Oh. They've got quite a few reinforcements, if I do say so myself. Okay. <laughs> It's okay, just calling your own reinforcements. Yeah. 
I can totally just do that. Um. Yo, having bleed is so overpowered. I love it. More of them! Well done. Blank. Blank. And we are victorious. Oh, that isn't all of them. We have more traders to deal with. Oh, quite a few potential traders. Thought about searching for the Holy Grail, Mordred. Are we just not gonna answer her? Hmm. What's this? This is my lucky day. Definitely one of the things this game is lacking is um, discussion amongst the party members. They don't talk to each other. Help me! I'm wounded. It hurts. What happened to you? I refused to join them. I fought them and they locked me here. They broke my leg. You are a true god of Camelot. Let me heal your wounds. Oh gods! It works. Thank you. Do you want me to join you? Yeah, sure, we can always use one more sword. It's a mace. Sorry. <laughs> Whatever. You. Just use it. God must have a reason to arrange that our pathways crossed Mordred. That's the reason I joined forces with you. No, yeah, well, I'm a filthy heathen. Heathen. I will not be a man of God. Take a look at this. What an interesting find. I know that troubadours only sing about the other Grail Knights, but I don't care. My sacred duty is all that matters. Fame is fickle. We don't want to fight you. We heard the sound of battle, and we all agreed not to fight you. We'll let you pass. Just go. Brave words. I made you let you live if you tell me the name of your leader. There are two knights. They are equals. One of them is Sir Landval. And who is the other? I... Um... I don't know his name. Sir Landval recruited us. Landval? I hardly remember this name. Where is he? He is in the old meeting hall. So be it. Keep your shabby lives. This war I'm waging here sometimes feels like a lost cause, but I must prevail. No 
one is allowed to enter this area. Look, someone is standing there. All strangers, do not disturb the noble dead. Um, who are you? What guardian? It's a powerful spirit guarding the remnants in the sacred tomb. Believe now. Tell me, whose tomb is this? This is the tomb. Oh, Uther. We will. Maybe not right now. The Lord giveth. An enticing treasure chest. Old, but suspiciously un, un but suspi fuck suspiciously unmarred. What does it contain? Lost riches, ancestral curse, or a grave mistake? Fling it open. I'll kick Uther's ass. Is that supposed to be Uther? No, it's Uther's guardian. All right, well, we'll do this. Boom. Oh, he resisted the vulnerability. Okay. There. Boom. Oh, Uther's coming for me. I do believe this is uh, just medieval. Yeah, uh, the XCOM. Except here in this game, you don't miss on a 90%. They don't give you percentiles. You pretty much, I think you always hit. But I have, I have never played. I've never played XCOM. It's never, never was my sort of thing. Hopefully the guard lives. Fighting. <laughs> really targeting a uh, cirque there, Guardian. <laughs> Look the same. 
I see a shrine. Regain armor. Yes. Uh, Sir K. Declaration of Loyalty. I, Sir Lanville, declare that Sir Mordred is unworthy of leading Camelot and the Round Table. I agree to join the Rebellion in order to remove him from his position and replace him with someone more entitled. Signed by Sir Lanville and Sir K. Wait a minute. We should talk about this letter. Yes, you owe me an explanation, sir. I signed this letter, but I was wrong. I changed my mind. Sir Mordred... You are the right person to save Avalon. You are still with us, killing traitors. I don't doubt you. Thank you. Your judgment is right, and I'll prove it. Yeah, that's one of the things I've heard about uh, the XCOM games. Or I, I, I used to watch a little bit of gameplay about it, but it's like always like uh, sometimes with games like this, yeah, they can be. It's hard to, I think with games like this, it's very hard to balance that uh, difficulty and to being it challenging uh, and like balancing the difficulty on games like this. Careful, one. it's a trap. They're waiting for you. Help me. Okay. <laughs> Who the fuck's this guy? Protect the servant. Uh -huh. Is he always gonna hurt? He's always gonna have. The only one I can hit. With the vileness. Okay. And him. Christ on the cross. <laughs> Yep, bleed got him. Okay, bitches. Your 
Baba Vui? Hmm. Let's go back to the campfire back here real quick. Um, don't really need that over armor. We'll take the HP. Time to get up, knights. Is this guy pulling his weight? Uh, for what he's able to do, yes. <laughs> For his skill set, yes, because he's not—he's not a—he's not, not a sir. He's just a mace dude, just a regular soldier. So. Rest and heal here. Yes, so then we can get our full armor. I feel refreshed. I miss the simplicity of the old times, Mordred. We knew our enemy, and we stood against you. I remember. Gain XP? Oh, fuck yeah. Uh... Lady Dendrain. I really like, uh, the archer abilities, man. The archer is really fucking cool. It's him. It's okay. The one who betrayed us. Who returned here with the Knights of the Broken Table. Let me guess. This is Sir Lanval. He is. I suspect he is feeling betrayed. Never heard of him. And by now I never will. My name is known. And it will be. My father was the knight who... No more, no more Pathfinder. I'm fucking... That pissed me off. Uh, they... We went to an area where there was this, like... Horde, um, like it, it, it was a spy, a tiny spider horde, and so the only way you could damage them was by throwing uh, AOE. Well, because of how that game is set up, um, I only had one AOE character once I had used up all of the pots because the acid pots they kept missing every single character I gave some. Each character missed. Even even the ones that probably were supposed to be the only character throwing the pots, because maybe it's like a class thing that makes them less likely to miss or something. They also missed. So I got sick of just missing every single thing. Uh and it's like, no, this isn't this isn't a true this isn't truly random. This is skewed in favor of missing. Get the fuck out of here. Uh, uh, yes. Someone whom I also never heard of. He slayed a dragon with a single sword. He killed a couple of giants alone. He fought the unseelie witches. Are you sure your father was a knight, not a troubadour? I was raised to respect the ways of the knights. To be worthy to the round table. Not like you. Except you never had a seat at it. You still believe you will? Yes. And I challenge you to a knightly duel. One against one. Knight Did I at least knight. find a path? 
Prove to me. Found many Prove paths. This it is as stupid as it sounds, but I accept it. Knights of the Broken Table. Name your champion. I am waiting. Yo, sir balling ballin', go kick his ass. Is this any good? Dude, this is fucking poggers. Still standing. You won. You can take my head, but I'm begging you. Let my men live. Wait. This rebellion was my idea, not his. I'm the one who's responsible here. Uh, is it, uh, but, uh, it's very, uh, if you've ever played XCOM, Wookie, which, well, you give me the vibes that you've played XCOM. This is medieval XCOM, except you don't mi you, you know you don't miss on a seventy percent because they don't give you percentages. You you, you just hit. Uh, it's King. It's a King Arthur retelling. I think it's really good. Uh, not far enough in the story really to say anything on the story. I, I'm intrigued by the story. Uh, the voice acting at least. Uh, the voice acting is okay. It hasn't wowed me. There was one instance last night where a si like a a random like NPC uh, talked to us, and that was some bad voice acting. <laughs> um, kind of sounded like maybe they gave it to I don't know maybe they just gave the person bad uh, bad uh, directions or something, but yeah. Uh... The stories. Uh... It, at least from what I've read of uh, um, Arthur and Arthurian retellings and stuff, this so far has a fair uh, is a pretty unique uh, retelling of the tale. Um, you didn't choose Mace Guy? No, Mace Guy I couldn't uh, pick because he wasn't a named character. Also, I think he would have lost. Mace Guy, I think, would have got his shit wrecked. The game I link that's better than Star Citizen. I mean, it doesn't take much to be better than Star Citizen. If your game can, you know, run at more than 2 FPS, you're better than Star Citizen. Uh... Why did you do this? It was hard to forget what Mordred did, and I thought Camelot deserves a better ruler. Still, you changed your mind, unlike him. I did, and this knight would do the same. I know him. Why would he? This man is a strong knight, brave and proud. We all saw him fight, right? He is eager for honor and reputation. But to the point, sir, okay? It's just an advice. Show some forgiveness. And he shall be useful at the round table. We know that he is worthy. Mm, I don't really need him. I'm not going to lie. Because Sir Balling Ball in here is the same class, I think. But, fuck it, sure. You shall be given a chance. Long live Sir Mordred and the Round Table. I am honored to serve him. Oh, he's a different class, I guess. Than Sir Balling Ballin. Yeah, he is. Oh, okay. I am humbled by the Lord's gift. He's talking a lot this chapter in this quest. What's up, Mace dude? You you survived the whole fight. Not gonna lie, a little a little surprised by that one. Day.
What should happen to Sir K? Uh, the trail, the trails of the pitiful rebellion against my rule led back to Sir K, which was truly not a surprise considering our conflicts in Britannia. What amazed me, though, was his boldness to admit his role in the conspiracy, claiming that he did everything for the throne. I appreciate that he was ready to stand up for his beliefs and risk his life for Camelot. Maybe a more suitable member of the round table than I had thought. Okay, so Sir Balin will be upset -y. But Sir Kay will be more loyal. Yeah, and only for 200 gold. Not really worth. Okay, I think we poison attack. Um Power attack. Why is he less loyal to me? Fucking bitch. I'm literally going the exact opposite of this, of Sir Ector. Because I'm not going Christian and I'm not going Tyrant. All right, so you vain. No, uh, the opposite of Christian is old gods. It's pagan. Uh, opposite of tyrant is uh, rightful. The name. Okay, um, ba ba ba. Build tower. You can sacrifice your useless relic item to gain relic dust from them, then buy new unique relic. Ooh. Okay. Master of Magic, that's going to go to Hector. And then, okay, that merchant. Uh, hospice. I don't think anyone's injured. Um, but.
Okay, can't buy any upgrades there, so I think we'll do that upgrade. Train. Hector. So you Bane leveled up. Yep. Salon Vo. Here's the morality chart. Uh, you get. Have a, no, have a good rest of your day, juxtapose. If this goes on sale. Yeah, I bought this on sale as well. <laughs> Which, uh, honestly, I pretty much only buy my games on sna on sale, Wilkes, except for God of War, Horizon, Plague Tale, Star Wars. <laughs> All right, back to the map. Oh. Life in Camelot is getting louder and more hectic, and the reason for the disorder is, not surprisingly, the tavern. Last night, my vassals finally went too far. During a drunken revelry, a section of Camelot almost burned down. The flames were put out in the last minute by the drunken knights. Something needs to be done, even if my men deserve the distraction. Uh, Christian heroes and rightful heroes will be happy. Tyrant heroes will be more loyal. Tyrant heroes will get unhappy i think we'll take the 500 gold all right so we have a new side mission at the old monastery our scouts discovered forgotten ruins in the wilderness where the magic of the old gods still feels strong they also stumbled upon a fabled sanctum Rumored to be visited by the Lady of the Lake for centuries to perform arcane rituals. These ruins seem to be harboring grave dangers and secrets. It's a fitting place for some daring knights to pay a visit. Hmm. Think. We'll do the old monastery. A pilgrim has collapsed at our doorstep, barely alive, bracing an infected wound, bearing alarming news. The infamous robber Baron Dumlock attacked and pillaged a convent with his brigands. Driven from their homes, the monks are pleading for help. A courageous friar shall act as our guide at the edge of the monastery. Okay. Meet Friar Kamlar. They are not brigands. You can let them pass. Skyrim? What Skyrim thing? Please help me, brave knights. I got robbed, and I need my valuables back. Oh, yeah. We shall get your things. Stay right here. I will never forgive you for what you did, Mordred. But maybe you are what this land needs. Who knows? place of devotion um i'm gonna leave that for now <laughs> my god what an interesting find we're not suffering from 
Ow. Oh, it's blood, so I'm guessing it's gonna be a vitality thing. Damn it. I fucked around and found out. Finally, some friendly faces. Our prayers to the Lord Almighty were not in vain. You're barely standing, Friar. I'm still alive. This wound is nothing, just a punishment for my sins. Oh, I don't want points into Christian. Keep suffering then and start talking. Just a day ago, Sir Dumlock showed up at our humble monastery. Despite his infamy, we welcomed him like good Christians, offering him shelter and bread. You mean Dumlock, the Marauder Knight? We didn't have much choice. He arrived with a band of brigands. They put everyone to the sword who resisted. And then? They couldn't agree on sharing the plunder. Now the knight sits in our monastery while the brigands are destroying the countryside, fighting each other. We have no time to waste then. I know the land like the back of my hand. I will mark some locations on your map to pray and rest. All right, you stay here. A bit to explore here. Ready to fight. I fight for honor. Oh. And he's dead. Oh. Attack. Move there. Poison this guy. Damn. Yeah. Uh, if we can get him to bleed. Yep, he'll go down. He'll go down. Down with the violence. Let's count the bodies, shall we? All right, that went pretty fucking smooth. Okay, how do I fucking want to explore this, though? Oh. 
I don't want to miss any loot. Like that 18 gold is very, very important, you know? What's going on here? Okay, so those are bad guys. There's no line of sight on anyone right now. Let's see if she gets more line of sight. Okay. Corey is his name. <laughs> what a nerd. Oh, he blocks me. The Lord is my witness. Your command? Okay, okay. Rid of him. I fight for honor. For Avalon. <laughs> on the cross. Okay, you little hoe. Get over here. For the Lord Almighty. Oh. There we go. Bitch. Stood our ground proudly. A prize for the blood and sweat.
This war I'm waging here sometimes feels like a lost cause, but I must prevail. I think we've heard you say that already. Okay. Just, just saying. Hmm. What are you? Hmm. Ah. A prize for the blood and sweat. Who's over here? Intruders. Get ready. Oh, there's a fucking good amount of you. Not enough to kill me. You coward. Fucking dodged it, of course he did. The Lord guides my hand. Fucking alive just a little longer. For the Lord ah. Almighty. Damn it. God, motherfucker. Bitch. Your head Die. Is mine. Die. <laughs> Let's count the bodies, shall we? I hope to find something more. Are you praying for forgiveness, Mordred? All the sins you have committed in Britannia must weigh heavily on your soul. Armor is fine right now. Curious what this guy will give me for his stone stuff. You have returned with my valuables, brave knights. The tears of joy. Here, take better care next time. XP. Okay.
Let's kneel down and pray. Mm, no, not yet. They tell me that Avalon used to be a charming place before I arrived here. If that's true, it has all truly gone to shit. I dedicated my life to the teachings of the Lord Almighty. Do you wish to gain faith, Lamb of the Lord? Yeah, fuck yeah, sure. A blessed spot to rest. Hmm. Treasure lost and found. Armor, armor, armor. Kit. Okay. HP one, though. That's not bad. Oh, shit. A bunch of fucking archers? Okay. Okay. The Lord Almighty. Oh, I shouldn't have moved. So, okay. Just a flesh wound. Just a light injury. Oh, fuck. Blessing. Sir Balling Balling, get the fuck out of there, my guy. Sinners shall bleed. Run away, Sir Balling Ballin. I am here to serve. Fuck yeah. God have mercy upon their soul. Ooh. Okay. Alright, Sir Balin. Uh, we're gonna go get you some help. <laughs> then... Use the ar campfire over here to restore our armors. Ready. 
ready to serve the Lord. Fear me, hate me, despise me, revere me. I don't care. All that matters is that the realm survives. People always thought me a heartless tyrant. But I always kept the interests of the realm in sight. I mean, dude, your armor isn't really helping people... Helping you with the people's perception of you. Damned bootlickers! How can you serve that bastard to you? You are fighting for crumbs. You rabid dogs are going to die to the last men. Okay. Defend yourself. They don't like each other. Awaiting your command. For my Camelot. See, in like a, in, in a different game, other games would have this situation be uh, the enemy not focusing on uh, on uh, their them fighting themselves, but instead they would all just gang up on the hero. And that shit is fucking annoying when the game tells you like, oh, these people don't like each other or whatever. For the Lord Almighty. Let me cut you to size. Oops. They don't like it. Yeah. But I've always... I, I just... That always pisses me. Like, uh, fucking... That's what happened in Divinity Original Sin 2. I'm quite proficient with if I'm remembering arrow. right. I've never wanted to wield a blade, but when I grab an in the arrow, final boss fight... I can feel God guiding my hands. They were supposed to be fighting each other, but it was just... Me getting fucking targeted. Man, the more I think the more I think on Divinity Original Sin 2, the more uh I kinda don't like it. <laughs> like, let me tell you strong opener. Chapters one and two are Amazing. That final chapter sucked. Easy there. I hoped for something more. You just really want to test your armor. Yeah, I... Have you ever thought about searching for the You asked this already. 
I hope we don't end up with super repeatable dialogue in this game. Please help. They're trying to rape me. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! That's a huge escalation. You're welcome. I wonder if we'll get any customization options for Mordred or if we're just going to look like a devil. Take a look at this. Who's going to need this? Uh, we need this. A place to share food and stories. I suspect that you are not a really good bowman, Mordred. But believe me, in capable hands, it's a match to blades. The best has left me here to die while they're having a jolly good time in the blacksmith's hut. Why the honesty? Why? Because I want all of them to die. You will get your revenge, traitor. The marksman's leader is a cocky bastard. He throws a fit if anyone dares to use his old nickname. You can turn this to your advantage. How could this be an advantage? Just call him Dunkface and you'll see. Good to know. Dunkface. Okay. Have a look. Hey, dung face. Which one of you idiots ran his bloody mouth? Hmm. We're in trouble, boys. <laughs> That's one way to put it, my friend. Your Highness? Oh. Oh, perfectly lined up for Sir K. I serve the Lord. Sinners shall bleed. I must accept that my rebirth in Avalon has been slowly changing me, for better or worse. Help. Don't know yet. Let's have a look. Ready to fight.
Off with his head. Down with the violence. <laughs> <laughs> What do you mean? I I feel like we did that like as smoothly as possible. I don't know how that really could have gone better. Alrighty, howdy lads. One second, gonna refill my my water. Our water is refilled. Uh, move that. Move that. Hmm. Go there. Right, they're ganking up on falling ballin rude Prepare to what you get for gang up on hmm Right there we can head on. And that'll be enough. Stood our ground proudly. Okay, let's refill armor with the campfire out this way. Another fine day. Then we'll go heal up, HP back, campfire, courtyard. Ready to serve the 
fuck shit up. Welcome to my humble abode, knights. Some wine, perhaps. Drop your weapons until you. Must have been a feat to sack a monastery. Straight to the point, eh? I heard you fighting from a mile away. Don't you want to sit and discuss the matter like noble knights? Like why you were slaughtering some monks for nothing? Being an honorable man got me deprived of my inheritance. Now I take anything, whenever I need it. Surrender and we might not hang you like a thief. A fair offer, but I must refuse. I'm not kneeling or fighting for anyone but myself. Defend yourself then, dumb luck. Huzzah! Uh. We'll have... Larger to come in here. Ready to fight. I serve the Lord. Your orders? Fire, that'll deal with the crossbow. Down with the virus. For king and country. Him. Move there. For the Lord Almighty. The round table. <laughs> nice and easy. Oh, we got a relic. Oh, let's go. Uh, does is the front will the friar want to say anything? Will he be like, nice job, dudes? He's probably not gonna say anything. They would have. Probably marked it. I don't think this is that kind of game. It has you. Yeah. Not that kind of game. Okay. Lady Dindrain's vision. I had a visit from Lady Dindrain, who has been on the hunt for the Grail since she came to Avalon. She told me about a dream she had about her brother Sir Percival, the famous Grail Knight. In her vision, Percival was standing next to a majestic throne and warned her about the holy relic being in grave danger. Lady Dindrain wants to solve this dream riddle and asks for my permission to visit the Great Library of the Red Abbey. Lady Dindrain can go, but she must return to Camelot with anything she learns about the throne. Yeah, fuck yeah, you can go. So extra level oh all right me we have one skill point um yeah test stigma lasts longer The only thing that sucks is we might lose Lady Dindrin because she's morally a 
Christian. That away from her though. Uh, da, da, da. So Sir Balin can have some HP on him. Um, so Ector. Uh, you have two points available. Let's get the cathedral towering above the timbered rooftops. This majestic building preaches the glory of the one true faith. The cathedral offers salve not only for the soul, but also for the body. You can heal the most grievous wounds of your knights here. Using potions. Oh shit, that is... OP. Okay, we have only 900. So we can't get any upgrades right now. Um, I guess we'll take Sir Ector with us on this next mission. A nervous looking man begged for an audience and started rambling about Sir Ector who burned down his tavern in a drunken rampage. I've heard some quite unknightly tales about my knights seeking all kinds of pleasures outside Camelot, but this one went too far. On the other hand, I appreciate that this mess happened outside the walls of the stronghold. On the other, my knights should show a bit more dignity, at least while they serve under my banner. Uh, ooh, oh, Mr. Ector. I could pay for it. I'll lose plus, yeah. So, Ector, you are costing me money. All right, to the Forbidden Keep. Our scouts discovered forgotten ruins in the wilderness where the magic of the old gods still feels strong. They also stumbled upon a fabled sanctum. Already listened to that dialogue. Behold my seat of power. Where magic and blood ran free under the moonlight to please the old gods. Here it lies, now haunted, forgotten, slowly swallowed by a fetid swamp. I wish you could heed my warning and leave the place undisturbed. Hmm. People always thought me a heartless tyrant, 
but I always kept the interests of the realm. Swiftness. Hello. I'm trapped in this ring of stone until I rise or fall in a nightly bout. There is no other way for me to earn my freedom. Okay, fight him. He didn't even touch Sir K. yourself apparition i'm the guardian of these sacred grounds bound to serve the lady of the lake are you ready to fulfill your purpose what purpose speak why do you keep squabbling to my eyes your mortal flesh is withering and dying we speak. How about now? By the gods. Enough of the riddles. I was betrayed and stripped of my powers. In need of help, I cast a stone in the ocean of time. So you would come. You want me to come? <laughs> Sorry. I swear I'm 24 years old, Tarada. I swear. The undead, and you shall be well rewarded. What if we refuse? Your actions and allegiances speak otherwise. He's got me there. <laughs> Show the way. A place to share food and stories. So far, Avalon has been a place for grand adventures and no consequences. Well, not anymore. Um. Hello? you not to go through the bloody swamp we're going to die here you idiot
going to fight. For the round table. <laughs> Not allowed to come back. You guys are welcome. Thank you for saving my life. Please take this as a token of my gratitude. Thank you. Wow. So much gold. The sanctum was guarded by secret order. Ever since the gods made men walk the earth, warriors, much like yourselves. Devoted knights of the old faith. The land is littered with the bones of the unwanted souls who ended up on their blades. Okay. I know that you have never taken me seriously, Mordred. I will prove you that you were wrong. I miss having Archer Lady. She was so fucking cool. Prepare to die. Interesting. A place to heal or mend armor. After the battle of Camlan, the guardians of this place were beckoned to this distant shore by the lady of the lake. They left in a hurried and evil magic. This one can barely by sorcery. Hmm, okay.
Ha! Ho! Oh. What? Shake it off. Your orders? Hmm. Can't see. Can't target anyone. This guy's annoying. Fucking hell. The feeling he's talking about the Lady of the Lake. Resting is over. Yeah, we're gonna go repair the armor. Maybe I should have swapped that, sir. Nothing like a good sleep. Falling ballin' for Sir Yvain. Watch me.
Unbreakable armor, you say? to make sure he doesn't come back. this <laughs> look what I found take a look at this treasure lost and found Yeah, we're gonna get attacked here. Yikes. Well, I'll bring it on, you bitches. Oh, what the fuck? There's a lot of them. Indeed it is. Yes. Oh, I'm the guardian knights. 
ghosts of the old faiths returned here. They brought a terrible curse on this land. An evil presence, like a black cloud, arrived in their wake, raising the dead, consuming everything. My sanctum was desecrated, rendering me powerless. So there's the tale. All right, here's the thing. I think we replenish arm. Hmm. No, I don't. I think we hold off. We hold off. We keep being greedy. We keep being stingy. Our resources. So this could prove fatal. Oh, shit, there was a... This one is a conjurer. Uh-oh. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have been greedy. Okay. 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 Okay, I gotta deal with the totem. There are two totems. Alright. Um... Sir Mordred. Sir Ector. We're going to target these totems. Okay, heal. <laughs> Okay. 
Get him, boys. Another light armor relic? Come on, give me a relic for the heavy armor, boy. What is this? Swiftness? Fuck. What is this thing? First pick should be mine. All right, we're going to go for armor. Hey, you can rest in the grave. Get that health up. <clears throat> Ready to serve the Lord. Take a look at this. I hoped for something more. Don't we always? If I just avoid it. Fate has a cruel sense of humor, Mordred. We fight as one, yet we are supposed to be sworn enemies. Gain XP. Sir Mord. to our cause. An intrusion try you fuck. An enticing treasure is old but suspiciously unmarred. What does it contain? Fling that chest open, baby. Right. Open that chest. What's the worst that could happen? Yeah. He looks harmless. He looks like he just wants a hug.
course they didn't. Trying to find that last artifact. Please and thank you. There it is. As a former seneschal of the king, I carry on my duties here in Avalon in his absence. Okay, I didn't ask. Your luck or fate. A blue rune and a trophy. Cool. And XP. Take a look at this. All right, I'll take the XP. <laughs> look what I found. Excuse you, I found it. resides in that statue. I have to cleanse it to regain my powers. What do you want us to do? I stand guard until the ritual is complete. As soon as I reveal my presence, the lost ones will come shrieking. How long does the ritual take? I should be well within your human lifetime. <laughs> Wait a minute. When the time comes. Yeah, you get ready. Oh, shit, of course they're going near Sir Ector. Can you go? You can get up to there. All right. <sighs> he can't respawn. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Sir fucking ballin'. I am here to serve. Sinner shall bleed. Right, end it. Yeah, he Your said taint. <laughs> spoke louder than the ceaseless mortal bickering. Uh, now I have to rest to fully regain everything I lost. Your reward is waiting as we agreed. Yo, he turned into a treasure chest. Nice. This is my lucky day. 
believe that is the map explored. Finish mission. Dang it. Uh, bah, bah, bah. Lady Dendrain was always beloved by the commoners and the nobles alike. A rare example among my knights. Asking my support to hold a fair in Camelot is, an ex is also an excellent idea. Coming from this gallant knight, though a suspicious, suspicious soul would say such degree of popularity should be reserved to the king and the king alone. Uh, all heroes, yes. Vitality your hands resist the health taking damage. Okay, we have two skill points. Plus 15% weapon strike. Uh, target also loses two armor. Ooh. I think we'll take the poison. All right, Sir K. Um Lady Dindrain has returned to us. Huzzah. Um. Hmm. Fallen. Initiator. That. Uh. Bitch boy. The dude who probably won't stay loyal. Um, All right, so I'm going to need to you know. All in, you stay there. Merchant. Um, how much?
shit. I believe everyone has a title, yeah. Um, Okay, let's go to the adventure map. Oh, we got a couple of events. The bridge, once guarded by Tevelin and his sons, led to the land of despair. And we brought back this despair with us in the form of a deadly fever that inflicts crippling pain and scarlet boils. The more superstitious souls whisper about the curse of the Night of Midnight, and perhaps they are right. The battle-hearted Knights of Camelot are somewhat resistant to this plague, but it spreads like wildfire among the common folk. Something has to be done before I lose my kingdom without unsheathing my sword. Let's see, we could, uh, Sir Yvain will suffer an injury, though. And the infected. I opened the gates of Camelot to the victims of the Scarlet Plague. This terrible sickness spread by the risen dead. It was a gamble in many ways, but this decision cemented my reputation as, reputation as a just and rightful ruler. Swag. A small group of friars under the protection of a reclusive Christian Brotherhood, the Order of the Seraphim, started to raise the ancient ruins of Thistlewood to build a Christian temple in its place. Such zeal has its benefits. After all, this place was a source of constant problems for Camelot in the past, yet several knights reject that drastic solution. Some say, even say I should reform the ancient knightly order that once tried to solve the mysteries of this place and unwillingly unleashed the undead curse. Reform the order and study the ancient ruins. I need Lady Morgana. <laughs> I need her. Uh, is there the Red Knight? Black Knight? Okay, so... Guinevere is not a thing. Got it. Sir Ector is worried about the fate of a good friend, Abbot Elianes. The deeply religious sorcerer and holy man gathered his devout followers to retake the ruins of an ancient Christian cathedral from the lost. No one heard about the abbot ever since. This needs our attention. We must find out what happened. All right, let's go help the abbot. Valon has always been a place where different traditions existed side by side, but Christians who practice ancient magic. It's something new and strange even for me. Christians are indeed strange. Yes, I agree. Before we wade deeper into this godless quagmire of bones, just a word, mates. What's on your mind, Sir Hector? Abbot Lyles is a good friend of mine. He's well versed in sorcery. 
It still serves the Lord Almighty, just like me. Why did the abbot come here? He couldn't bear the thought of the lost treading upon the ruins of a Christian cathedral. And what do you know about his fate? I interrogated a servant who fled and left Elias behind. After entering the ruins, they got swarmed by the lost. The abbot was last seen raising magical barriers, locking himself inside the ruins. Do you really think the abbot is still alive? We have to find out ourselves. Those protective barriers are impenetrable until the lost are banished, so the abbot could still be alive. Kill the lost to get to your friend. That's it? I see no other way, my friends. Let us go, then. Look. This may serve a higher purpose. Welcome, brave knights of the round table. Come, step closer. We are here to pay for your services, old hag. How could I resist such nice words? I can offer you an arcane blessing that will make you fight stronger, but it will cost you. You're not that desperate. I don't need a plus 20. I'm strong as fuck, dude. Look. Rar. Sinners shall bleed for the Lord Almighty. There. Wing. That's how you do that. Down. Let's deal with the other. I am humbled by the Lord's gift. It's all hazy. I battled King Arthur and we both died. And still we both live. Abbot Elias told us to gather around and handed our weapon, out weapons we never wielded before. Then we knelt down and prayed together. He told us that we were going back to the cathedral and cleanse it in the name of the Lord. I was such a fool, now I'll die here alone.
treasure chest. This is my lucky day. Oh, fuck yeah. Who's this? Let's have a look. Look right there. Have you ever thought about searching for the Holy Grail, Mordred? You've asked this before. Hello, lads. Hold, stranger. Prove that you are not of the undead. What the hell? We are still breathing. I'm like your maggot-ridden corpse. Stop <clears throat> mocking me, you devil. Okay, is that because I got the horns? Understandable. Fuck you. It's mine. Look right there. Treasure lost and found. Page from a chronicle. The abbot led us into the midst of the undead horde, weaving holy spells and carrying the Lord Christ's name on his lips. God, there were so many of them. We followed him in blind faith only to get slaughtered like lambs. He reached the cathedral, but we didn't, and I don't know what will happen to us now. Ah, dude, come for your treasure chest, if you don't mind. Please. Please, not gonna work. Okay, fair enough. Oh shit, there's a lot of them.
you. Fuck you. Feel the pain. are down now we are free to continue our way making our way making our way pure luck or fate a just reward Sacred place. I'm proficient since I use it. Uh, for martyr? Ah, more armor. Okay. Serve Camelot all my life and beyond. Only the realm matters. People are servants to the idea of the, the torn king. piece of vellum with scribbled words on the page. And imagine stumble through the door into the cathedral just before the abbot erected the barrier. Only the two of us made it. He laughed like a madman, berating me for being weak. And we saw the dead waiting for us inside, standing in silence. I ran and hid in panic. I think I'm gonna bleed out. Do we stop here? Yes. Recover the armor here. I think I deserve a longer break. I've heard movement. Get behind cover. I have a bad feeling about this. What are you, a Jedi? An ambush? But we were prepared. Three waves of them? The Lord guides my hand. Your Highness? What? This is the last guy, that's the last guy. Okay. No, it's not the last guy, this is wave two. Ow! Yuck.
Yeah, he's gonna come back. Yeah. I am here to serve. I serve the Lord. The Lord is my witness. I am. I get out of breath pretty quickly. No stamina. It's a shrine. Heal HP. Hidden train. All right, this is where we begin this little journey. Any loot? No loot. Yep. But a fight. Oh shit, didn't mean to okay. Yep. I deserve that one. Yes, line up for my boy. Off with their heads. HP is still looking good. The campfire. Look there. Just in case there's another fight that comes. Hmm. Garbage or real treasure this time. But he has forsaken me. We have too late. It's already dead. I fought so hard, even after my flock left me to die. But it wasn't enough. So I locked myself inside to complete a sorceress ritual, but only turned this place into my own tomb. And how did you die? When I was too weak to stand, the undead broke in and tore me apart. I died in horrible agony, only to live again. Do you know who you are? Everything is fading away. I can't even remember my name now. You are Abbot Elios, the holy man who practiced spellcraft. Yes. Yes. There is still hope then. Join me in eternity so Wait a minute, we can what? build this temple. How about we put you to rest? You will see everything differently when you join me in this unlife. No, thank you. Us uh, actor, slow him.
And swing. Christ on the cross. Yo. Okay. Taste of blade. Serve the Lord. She can hit him. Perfect. I was truly lost for words when I saw him. Such a horrible fate for a devout Christian and a good friend. But it was the will of the Lord. Kind of a fucked up will, if you ask me. A sad fate indeed. At least the abbot is at peace now. We all should pray for his soul, my friends. May the gods take him higher. Regardless the matters of faith, thanks for your help, knights. Don't even mention it. I am humbled by the Lord's A lucky gift. charm. Hmm, don't mind if I do. Got some loot back here. Finish mission. The abbot of the old monastery may be uncomfortably gifted in scheming, but he could also be also a worthy ally. The time he sent a newly anointed priest to Camelot, who... This time he sent a newly anointed priest to Camelot, who is an excellent orator and pragmatic mind, according to his letter of commendation. The young dean wasn't bothering me with theoretical problems. Instead, he immediately asked for guidance about what he should preach here. Let's see, Lady Dindrin and Hector. Lady Dindrin and Sir Hector. They're balling, balling. Huh? Uh. Ooh, blast potion, thirty more, thirty percent more damage. I feel like I'm not going to use that. Oh, he has the highest armor, so maybe. Lady Dindrain. Uh, Actually, maybe it could that could prove pretty useful given her she can launch a powerful arrow like that. 
What sucks is she's Christian, and but she's so strong. Ah. Fallen. Um... No new events. Okay, cool. Um, but I don't think you can do anything for 450, can you? Not enough, okay. No, I don't, I don't need the armor. Okay, so upgrade the hospice. I'd love to get a second slot, but okay. That's that. We do the level five side mission or the main mission. Hmm. I don't know if. Man, I don't know if side, well, we'll do side mission just cause I mean, it might not be overpowered, right? <laughs> um, question is though. I think we bring Hector. Hector's just. Let's do Ancient Throne. Drain has been in search for the Holy Grail for a long time. She claims she sees heavenly visions that guide her steps. But this time she is certain that her last dream will lead her to the sacred artifact. She needs some knights to accompany her. And if she is right, this could be very useful for Camelot. Very well. <laughs> yeah. Huzzah! Or Camelot. The writings were clear. The ethereal throne is here. In this forest. What writings? An old scroll written in the language of the ancients. Do you speak that language? Nobody does. But the monks could translate some parts of the writing. And what is it about? It tells the legend of the ethereal throne of Avalon. The ethereal throne in an ordinary forest. Well, the throne is ancient, and this place wasn't always a forest. 
And whose throne is it? The writings didn't mention that. But the throne might be the Holy Grail itself. In my dream, Percival was standing right beside it. Fair point. Can we get there? Yes and no. The throne is here, but not now. Oh, yeah, I know it's this. It's hard to explain. I know this tale. The Give it a try. can be in the past or in the future. This part wasn't clear in the writings. If this throne of yours can exist anywhere at any time, how can we find it? If we want to reach the throne, we must enter the three ancient gates in the proper order. Just follow me. Fine. Lead us to the first gate, then. Percival would be very proud of me. I will find the Holy Grail. What do we have here? No. Nobody should meddle with those damn gates. I wish I could warn them. I recognize these statues. This is the first gate. I can feel the gate. But we can't see it yet. It's here, in this place, but not in this time. How do we enter, then? With the spell word from the ancient scroll. I've memorized it. It opens the gate, but the guardians will come to stop us. And who are these guardians? Who, if we are lucky? Or what, if we are not? Those writings of yours told nothing about them? It did. They will appear here from the River of Time. Or something like that. The monks were unable to translate this part. Are you ready? Use the word, we are ready. Oh, what the Matrak. fuck is up with my oh, ear, dude? Ah. No the gate is open. Enter. Just ahead. Let me just... Just in case. Oh my god. Goat people. Savages of the other world. Okay, okay, okay. Ah. Hit. Get fucked. Yourself. I am here to serve. Wing. It's done. The second gate is an old tree, and I know where we can find it. That's far away. Okay. All my life, I had these dreams. Dreams that showed me the past, or foretold the future. Who's this? My God! Things to plunder. Well, that's ominous. Hold it right there. Hold it right there. Business here. 
Bugger off till you can. How dare you talk to me like that? Let me teach you a lesson. I'm not afraid of you. Kill them all. Attack. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Damn, none of them could get close enough. Okay. Defend yourself. Chop, chop. And now we pray for forgiveness. Ah, that's so fun. So much fun. Trying to tell me the Lord put that there? I don't believe it. Those gates are forbidden even for me. They should have never come here. Here, the old tree. Let's try the spell word. Anal natrak, oh bas des bedak, no tiel dienna. The gate is open. Fancy words, magic lady. We have unleashed something powerful and terrible. He looks like a bitch to me. Oh. Oh, dear. Jesus. mine 
her. He is stunned. No mercy you bitch. You hope. Lord have mercy on us. What was that thing? I guess it was a warrior of the shit. Those unholy the... devils. Percival told me that the she are real, but the she. Okay. Whoops. Him. Not shit. She. Uh, they serve the old gods, but they are no devils. These are pagan words. I'm not even surprised that you know a lot about these monsters. Like it or not, we are in this together. We're all in this together. You are right. Go to the third gate. And the last gate might be even worse. We are looking for a strange rock formation. Ah, strange rock formation. I wonder what it could be. Where could the strange rock formation be? <gasps> yes. A relic heavy armor. Okay, I think we need to replenish our H our armor. I am humbled by the Lord's gift. Oh, wrong way. People think the Holy Grail is a chalice, but in Avalon, it could be anything. A relic, a belief, a person. Why not a throne? Or all of these at the same time? Okay. Um... Let's go to the third gate. First. These stones? Impossible. What are they doing in my realm? Look at those strange rocks. They look quite otherworldly. Do you know what these are? Who built them? The old writings referred to them as stones of doom. Fitting. It wasn't hard to recognize the place. Let me guess. This is the last gate, right? Yes, the gate is here. Somewhere. Sometime. What hellish creatures shall it cast upon us? Prepare your weapons. Say the words, we are ready. The gate is open. Enter. What the fuck, dude? Fuck. Fools, fools, what have you done? I must stop you. Well, the fucker almost one hit me. Get away from here now. You can't stop me from finding the throne. That throne is just an illusion. My vision called me here. It must be here. 
This is a forest where one day the grail might find its place. That's what drew you here. I don't. Is this Merlin? Of course you don't. Time has been broken. Th this has to be Merlin. All you did was to crawl through the cracks and fell into a potential future. You are trespassing. But how? I don't have time to deal with you. Leave, and the power of the forest will send you back to where you came from. We have no reason to stay, but trust me, I will not give up my search. Remember, this is a future that we all should avoid at any cost. I'm doing all I can to make sure it won't happen. The Throne of Doom is just a prophecy. It never shall become real, never. Yes, soon. Soon you will find the Grail, and you will regret it. Oh, what a bunch of idiots you are. All right. Um. Okay. We didn't take actual damage from that fight. Nice. Howdy, lad. Stop right there, good sires. This is a robbery. Are you Handle stupid? Persons. Quick. All you get is a shallow grave. We have some tough ones here, eh? Put them to the blade. Mercy for the wicked. You'll die. Bam, just like that. This may serve a higher purpose. Heal HP. Who's this? What's that? Oh, over there. Oh my. A scroll. Finish mission. Level six. Yeah. New challenge reward. Essence of deflection. Okay. So you vain. Um, freedom for two missions. Um, Overworld, what's the event? Uh, Camelot can be a crossroad for charlatans and lunatics, but this pox-scarred alchemist looks different. The stranger's presence may be uncomfortable, but the offer is tempting. In exchange for a quiet corner in the Enchanted Tower, I could benefit from his expertise. What troubles me is that he also mentioned living subjects for his experiments, although there are fitting candidates in the dungeon.
we just lose I'm just gonna politely reject it <laughs> Alright, let's... What the fuck? I can fucking cast Thunderbolt, dude. Yeah, I, I want Thunderbolt. Hmm, I don't really like that. Negative 25% total armor? <sighs> I only dodge. Yeah, no, not worth. I'm not. No. No, no, no. See what can you do? Um do robust. All right, um, All right, round table. Um, so we could get a little plus two. Second hero slot. Second hero slot. Every current and prospective hero gets up. Oh, nope. Can't. What about Cathedral? Second hero slot. Right, I think. What does he want? 
Uh, he's restless. Oh. I'm gonna set him the training ground then. We'll just have him train at the training grounds like all the time then. Uh. Old Faith Knight. Is he an old Faith Knight? No. But he can, he can have, he can have, he can sit there, I guess. Um, we'll just use the 1,000. The warrior queen, huh? As an act of fate, a wandering sage has stumbled upon the catacombs where allegedly the warrior queen of Britannia, Bodicea, was buried alive by the Romans of Eboracum. It is an unexpected and Eboracum. discovery, which is too important to dismiss. Okay. Uh... So we'll keep with this gang. This gang's been pretty good. About fucking shit up. Their actor is just strong as fuck. Evil sorcery, suffering, and despair. I can only grasp Zeus? a fleeting glimpse of the tragedy that unfolded here a long time ago. And I don't want to see more. I know that you have never taken me seriously, Mordred. I will prove you that you were wrong. A just reward. Sad dudes. How you doing? No, wait, fuck. Oh yeah, this this squad. This squad fuck shit up, dude. For this kingdom other than pain and suffering. Hey man, I think I've been doing a pretty good job since I've been reborn.
is my witness. Ooh, a relic staff. Okay. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, this is ominous looking. Stay warm. Don't really need to dispel What's the use of this. Go back around. <laughs> Take a look at this. A just reward. Finding a lot of scrolls in here. A good spot for resting. Gain XP. A desecrated resting place for the fallen. What does it hide? Untold treasures or a terrible end? Take my chances. I like loot. Maybe I, you know, I'm going to keep touching the, the, the dead. I'll keep touching them. With the 
Oh, hello. He'll be dead. looking okay. Take my chances. Ooh. There's a good amount of them. Here, fire. <laughs> On ability. Defend yourself. Okay. Uh, assuming there's going to be a fight. Let's go back to the campfires. Why is there so much to explore, but there's no... Well rested and ready. chivalry and faithful knights who are willing to sacrifice themselves Avalon is doomed time for the long walk around because I'm not paying the blood price to get the shortcut <laughs> what do they think I am ah shall guide my hand yo we just walked through a statue we are god I wonder if there is customization cause I don't like this look for Mordred he doesn't look like okay I, I hate this design in fantasy <laughs> I kinda I wanna look more like Sir K man Oh, 
shit. Okay. Um... Was that Boudica? Oh, balls. Okay. I cannot damage that. All right. Who's in range? Yeah, okay, I want to focus the big bitches. Down with the violence. <laughs> Wait, fuck you, prisoner. Star Hex, Force Bolt. I guess she's evil. She's gonna attack us. Okay. Three Queen Boudica. I could do that. Easy! Am I truly awakened? Or is it just another treacherous torment? What kind of apparition are you? This is real. We are the Knights of the Round Table. My mind tells me I'm dead. Yet with every breath, this body screams in agony. Kill me. I can't take it anymore. We are not going to kill you. Just hand me a dagger then. I don't want to live in shame. Are you really Boudicca? The warrior queen of Britannia? I was in another life. Now I'm just a broken mother consumed by grief. 
Unburden your soul and you will feel better. They lured me into a trap and forced me to watch as my two daughters were raped and slaughtered. Who? The decadent monsters of Aboricum. The Romans. The last Roman province in Britannia. Did they kill you then? Worse. I was sent into a deathless sleep to relive the horror over and over again here in the other world. Now that you are free, what will you do? While I was imprisoned here, my daughters came back from the dead to haunt me. Maybe there is uh -oh. still hope for them to find peace. Well, lead the way. This burden is so hard to carry. Uh oh. I raised my two daughters to be proud warriors like me. One day, King Uther's cousin and a Roman champion of the Ninth Legion came, asking for their hands. I just laughed and sent the suitors away. All right, we cannot by the get our archer in the danger. Us into a trap. We fought hard, but were quickly overpowered. I was whipped and spat upon while my daughters were raped by jeering men. Then they just slit their throats and would come forth as me. My second daughter, come. I'm here to break the bond that binds you here. Nope, nope, nope. What? effect poison and a bluey all right we gotta play real smart because i was stupid and of course the map was this big on purpose there is no greater tragedy than seeing your own children die so i thought back then how pitiful 
But they put me under a spell, trapping my mind in a never-ending, nightmarish dream. I have said, rise. My first daughter, Abria, rise. Let me free you from this curse. Hello, spooky lady. Oh, you've got a lot of a lot of guards, don't you? Aren't you special? Oh shit. Christ on the cross. Oopsies. The Lord guides my And that The Lord is my witness. And peace. Without your help, I would have wrought me here. Till the world's end. Listening to the screams of my kin. You're welcome. Maybe you were sent here by the old gods as a sign that I still have purpose. And what would be your purpose? From this day, I live for nothing but vengeance. Ah. If those monsters from Abora come find their way here, they will have to pay. Don't you want to join us? A lot of time has passed, and there is much to uncover. Damn. I need answers. Maybe we will meet again. Farewell. Let's see here. Bards and troubadours come and go, but sometimes you stumble into a true artisan with talent and passion. My Castellan swears this troubadour already sang himself out of Pictish cages in the sunless dungeons of marauding knights, and now he is offering me a song about Lord Mordred, the misunderstood hero and legendary swordsman in exchange for a modest gift. Um, plus one or a select hero. Lady Dindrain. 
super, super fucking loyal. Uh, let's see. Is there a new event? There is. Uh, Sir Lanval with the unexpected display of resourcefulness discovered a forsaken gold mine deep in the cursed lands. I can't even imagine what he was doing in the terrifying wilderness, but the discovery may prove helpful for Camelot. The only problem is the nearby Howling Grotto, a place sacred and protected by the Lady. My champion still thinks we should explore the ruins, regardless of the ancient place. Um... They're balling, balling. Right, back to Camelot. We don't have enough. Uh, all right. Let's look here. Uh, we, our character never really needs to. Alright, so K. Okay. Uh, that. Alright. That there, uh, healing potion. Boom, boom. So Ector. Plus five damage against vulnerable units. Units hit by the heroes of Texas is their opportunity. Fuck yeah. Um, you also, because of your fucking HP. We'll have you be a scroll, scrolly boy. Alright, your abilities, Ector. 25% hex. Ooh, fireball. Yes. <laughs> it's essentially fireball. Alright. Seria Vein. So Lanvo, Guardian of the Lady. Okay, uh, and then we'll sell. Keep that. All right, oh, we have a thousand now. I can upgrade that. Second hero slot here. All right. Oh, and no new side mission. Okay. Cool. I see. I, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing how the game works, and that's gonna be where we. Stop for today. God, this game is a blast. <laughs> uh, I have no clue how long it takes to beat. But 
a lot of fun. Uh, it's not like complex. Uh, I'm curious how long to beat. What what does how long to beat say for this game? Oh, that's not long. I thought it would be longer based on the amount of hours I've seen people on Steam reviews have it at. Uh, is anyone streaming right now? No, I'm streaming for two more, for like a minute, for one more minute. Uh, Tarada, Wookus, and Juxtapose, thank y'all for showing up and chatting. I will be live tomorrow night unless I am dead. That's a lie. I mean, there could be other things that happen that isn't my death that could prevent me from streaming. But honestly, the more likely thing happening is my death. So if I die, it was the government. Don't forget it. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. Good night.